going on everyone this is the mac roberts back again with another nba 2k21 my player build a video and today we're going to be taking a look at the best brandon ingram build now i made this build or i put this build together essentially because i just wanted to finish all of last year's all-stars and of course brandon ingram was an all-star last year so that's how this build came to be so without further ado let's get into the build position is going to be small forward hand in this doesn't matter jersey number also doesn't matter i just chose 14 because that's the number that he wore for his entire career for the pie chart we're going to go with the blue and green half and half pie chart and for the physical profile we're going to go with the speed invert physical profile now for the attributes you're going to bring your close shot up to an 82 your driving layup up to a 78 and max it out bring your driving dunk up to a 78 bring your standing dunk up to a 66 and you're gonna bring your post hook up to a 66. And that's gonna give you 12 finishing badges. For shooting, you're gonna bring your mid-range shot up to a 72. Your three-point shot up to a 76. Your free throw up to an 88 and max it out. Your post fade up to a 79. And that's gonna give you 18 shooting badges. For playmaking, you're gonna bring your pass accuracy up to a 70. Your ball handling up to a 71 and your post moves up to a 75. And that's gonna give you 13 playmaking badges. Lastly, for defense and rebounding, you're gonna max out your interior defense, max out your perimeter defense, max out your lateral quickness, and bring your defensive rebounding up to a 67. And you're not gonna get any additional defense and rebounding badges, but 12 finishing, 18 shooting, 13 playmaking, and one defense and rebounding badge is a total of 44 badges. Body shape doesn't really matter. I'm just going to go with slight. Height is going to be 6'7". Weight is going to be 190 pounds. That is his actual height and weight. And for the wingspan, you're going to bring it down to 81 inches. So at 99 overall, you're going to have a close shot of 84, an 84 driving layup, an 80 driving dunk, a 65 standing dunk, and a 69 post hook. For your shooting stats, you're going to have a 78 mid-range shot, an 82 three-point shot, a 92 free throw, and an 84 post fade. For your playmaking, you're gonna have a 74 pass accuracy, a 75 ball handle, and a 78 post moves. And for your defense and rebounding, you're gonna have a 59 interior defense, a 76 perimeter defense, a 75 lateral quickness, and a 69 defensive rebound. Your physicals at 99 overall with the gym at badge are gonna be 85 for speed, 83 for acceleration, 90 for vertical, and 57 for strength. For the takeover, you could either go with the slasher takeover or the sharp takeover. Uh, it's completely up to you. Uh, I'm just going to go with the sharp takeover though. And the build is complete and you have built an offensive minded wing. Shades of Brandon Ingram, Tobias Harris, and DeMar DeRozan. Now for your badges, for your finishing badges, you're going to put Acrobat on silver, consistent finish on silver, contact finish on silver, pro touch on silver, put back balls on bronze, relentless finish on bronze, and slither your finish on silver. For your shooting badges, you're going to put catch and shoot on silver, dead eye on silver, deep fades on bronze, difficult shots on silver, flexible release on silver, green machine on silver, hot start on silver, hot zone hunter on bronze, pick and popper on bronze, volume shooter on silver, and range extender on bronze. For your playmaking badges, you're gonna put downhill on gold, flashy passer on silver, quick first step on gold, space creator on gold, and stop and go on silver. And for your one defense and rebounding badge, you're gonna put it on pick dodger. All right, everyone, this has been the best Brandon Ingram build. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon and join the Penny Face Squad. That'd be greatly appreciated. It helps out the channel overall. And you'll also be kept up with everything we do in the channel. So you don't want to miss any of that. Drop a comment below and let me know what you thought of the build. I'm taking requests. So if you have a build that you want to see me make, let me know in the comment section below. And I'll try to make that build for you. I'm making builds every single day for next gen. Uh, I'm not doing current gen so much anymore, but I'll do it for a quest. So if you have a current gen build that you want to see me make, let me know in the comment section below as well. Just say, hey, I want this build for current gen and I'll try to make that build up for you. Last but not least, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.